All right, y'all, the vet that's going to castrate the bull told us to do a practice run of trying to get him in the barn because he has to be off feed and water for 24 hours. Well, feed 24, water 12. So this is our first time, like, being in the arena, if you will, with him. And the moment of truth. The moment of truth. Here we go. He's, uh, Lynn's letting him in this part of the pasture. We got some sweet feed in there. So, hoping he'll come in. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Shake it? Okay. Come and get it. Come and get it. Now I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna put it in the stall. Oh, okay. <laughs> Come on, buddy. He looks like he's handling it pretty well. Kind of nice. Just careful he doesn't hurt you. <laughs> or me. Good boy. Good boy. Hey, that's not so bad. I put it at the end there. If you just like throw it in, he'll see that. You just throw it in. <laughs> see him? Yeah. So I can't get this down. So just throw the bucket I in. Can't get oh, okay. Just let it go, and just let it go, and he'll go in and get the other one. Then we'll close it in behind him. Really, like, just throw it. Just throw <laughs> it. It's like he's not letting me get it up to throw it. <laughs> Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. There we go. Go on. Go on. You know you want some more. You're on YouTube, so you better behave. All right, bud. Good boy. Good boy. See, that's the problem child right there. That's why we're having to do this. <laughs> yeah, okay. Like all what all what males in this household, you gotta get clipped. <laughs> oh wow. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever, yeah. Somebody talked a big game for the guy who cracks a tight whip. Anyway, so that actually went a lot better. I'm gonna send this video to the vet who's gonna be very impressed because I told him we'd probably die doing this. And uh how do you feel? It's so fun. Fine. Can you give us a little bit more? Come on, I'm trying to build up my watch hours on, on YouTube. <laughs> um, oh. It went as expected. Which is? Cal install. Can you describe the feeling that you had? Were you nervous? Did you think he's going to stampede me? I'm going to need a rodeo clown. I wish I had worn a cup. Any of those things. A rosary. I mean, the thought... <laughs> The thoughts had had come to mind, but um, that's the executive producer. Uh, no, I was just Hang prepared on, to run. That's why I had my running shoes on. So. <laughs> okay. So. All right. Well, he looks like he's uh, not particular about color either. He doesn't mind eating out of pink, pink feeders. Hey, did I tell you you're supposed to, you are supposed to have shoes on back here. Please go wash off your feet and put your boots on. Okay, gross. Okay, anyway, so I'm actually, I'm happy about that. They're out there. Go grab them, but go you got to rinse your feet off, yeah, okay? Go on. Happy about that. So here's the plan. End of June, couple of weeks, at high midday, high noon, the vet's going to be here. And he said he's not going to know whether we can band him, which is basically, I think, if I understand correctly, putting a band around the top part and cutting off circulation or have to actually do surgery. He says he's not going to know for sure until he comes and sees daddy cow, as we call him. And uh, then we'll know. We'll know what we're in for. But he said either way, it's not a huge amount of maintenance afterwards to give them everything they need, I guess, uh, when the procedure happens and so we just you know we're monitoring for infection but apparently it's it's not 
It's not common, he said, anyway, so we'll see. <laughs> Here we are. Hey, buddy. How do you feel? Ooh, I didn't even look what's in that bucket. Nothing. Oh, here he goes. Let's see what he does now. Let's see what he does when he figures out that there's no more food and he's stuck in a stall. And you know what we should also do is check the female. See how she's doing if she's upset. Because she likes to have her buddy around. So, hey, mommy cow. Hey, mommy cow. What you doing, girl? Hey. Hey, mommy cow. Hey, mommy cow. That's what we call her. We still haven't named these guys yet, so. Hi, is your buddy back there? It's okay. It's okay. I'll get you some food. I'll get you some food. She's a lot more timid. And um, I, I did cut their sweet feed habit, but today is an exception because we had to get this battle plan together. So they're going to go back to being grass fed soon. <laughs> Just... Desperate times, you know? Okay, let's see how he's doing here, shall we? Hey, he already started pushing on it. He's pooping on what? Pushing on it. Oh, pushing on it. Oh, let's see. What do you think, dude? You all right? I think you're gonna be okay. I think you're gonna be just fine. Yeah. I think you're gonna be just fine. Give us a little kiss. Give us a little kiss. Yeah, oh, that's a good cow kiss. All right. Now can you tell everybody to like, share, and subscribe, please? Like, share, and subscribe. Or just say moo. Or say nothing. Okay, how do you feel about this impending surgery? You're not talking to me anymore. Very upset. Okay. Bye, everybody.